Hello, hello, and welcome to Games Revisited. It's episode 32, and we're continuing our playthrough of Knights of the Old Republic 2, The Sith Lords, and I almost knocked over my coffee. That would have been a tragedy of epic proportions, both for the coffee and for the tablet and keyboard. In particular, the keyboard, since I've already ruined one by spilling stuff on it. <laughs> and I don't want to wait for another. All right. So we crashed on Telos. We took care of upgrading our compatriot over there, arming him, giving him a little bit of armor. And uh, now that he's got his armor all, let's uh, let's go pick some more fights. These mercenaries think they're going to do something. Sentry droid, you say? I got something that'll fix his little red wagon. Mm, not a Sonic. But we can definitely do that. And then we'll queue up the flurries. Let's get him... Uh, no, let's leave him as aggressive. Oh, he's too far away? Are you kidding me? Come on, man. And she's too far away as well? Alright. Let's, uh, let's do this then. Let's see if we can go... No? Oh. Fine. Alright, so that's going to finish the stun. Everything else is going to happen from there. Let's get you, good sir. To queue up a few flurries of your own. And let's get you, now that you've hit that burst of speed, to throw some energy resistance. Uh, force barrier. Battle meditation. And then Valor. Oh, he's... Oh, uh, what part of any of that was what I queued up? <laughs> I, uh, come on. Come on. All right, fine. Let's double down on him. Let's just queue up the flurries. That's everybody? Good. This is the way we loot the bodies, loot the bodies, loot the bodies. Hey, how you doing? Yes, the memories indeed. Ooh. Ooh, a force pike. Ooh. That brings up a very good question. A force pike better than the two swords I got going right now. I'll have to look at that in a little bit. Let's mug him for his 56 bucks. And, uh, what's in the swoop bike? Uh, uh, code locked. Can't use it. And the land speeder? Uh, code locked. Can't use it. I thought there was a droid that died around here, too. Didn't, didn't he have anything useful? I got a couple of droids that could use parts. Surely he's worth some spare parts. No? No, nothing? <laughs> Good to see you doing well. Alright, so that handles that. Let's uh let's make our way on down. Another sentry droid. The mercenaries must be using them to locate us. There's probably another patrol nearby. Alright. Oh, I got something for droids. Zap him again! Finish him! He better be dead by the time I get there. Alright. Any... anything? No? Oh. 
I was hoping for some spare parts. <laughs> All right. Um, I really don't want to have to deal with these in combat. I don't think they're going to let me disarm them without on? starting a fight. But, uh... Huh. What luck? We did not expect to see you again. Oh, that's right. W weren't these the guys that, um... Yeah, there was a bounty on these guys. Alright, you seem happy to see me. I was just thinking the same thing. Looks like I'll be able to click on that bounty anyways. I mean, I'm really tempted for that one. Especially the kind of mood I'm in today. But... Let's go with I was just thinking the same thing. We thought our situation being stuck here on the planet's surface would keep us from collecting the price. But now you've thoughtfully delivered yourself to us. Eh, who delivered who to whom? We would be remiss to allow opportunity to pass us by a second time. Bounty? Why is there a bounty on your head? Uh, <laughs> none of your business. Uh, I'll explain it later. Don't you know? The exchange is paying handsomely for the head of a Jedi Knight. Your friend here just happens to be... I, I'm not a Jedi anymore. I left. But that's of little importance. All that matters is that we take them back to Narshada. You'll have to come through me if you want to take the general. <laughs> that was the plan anyway. Alright, um... Yeah. Oh, you batty lady. Okay. Alright. We'll get those queued up and then we'll get back to control of our guy here so we can do something proper about this. I'll finish him. Did, seriously, the computer burned through all my force points already? And a journal entry has been added. <laughs> is it about the bounty we can get on these guys? Because I definitely want to do that. Oh, he had one of those and he didn't use it? Good for me. Alright. And everybody is healing themselves along nicely. There we go. Everybody should be topped off except me, but that'll fix itself here in a minute. Uh, Alright, I'm only ten minutes in. Do I want to try to start a conversation with him or keep going a little bit? Let's try to start a conversation hey, with him real General, quick. Are you alright? Uh what are you talking about? You look like you've been standing too close to one of my shield generators. Uh, <laughs> you're one to talk. I was inspired by your arm. Are you sure you haven't been chewing on power cables? When one is in touch with the force, it can manifest itself visibly. Yeah, let's try that. Was there something you wanted me for? Um, how did you lose I your arm? I got tired of it. Kept dropping my hydro spanner. Figured I'd get a new one. Uh, let's go with I was being serious. If you were me, you'd probably want to joke about it too. Actually, it was a souvenir from Malachor. I was lucky I didn't lose more. But at least it gave me something to do, right? Everyone always said I was probably half machine anyway. Something else I can help you with. Alright, uh, let's ask his opinion about the Telos situation. If the Republic would just rein Zerka in, there'd be no problem. But as long as Zerka is allowed to undermine the Athorian's efforts, Telos will remain dead. I can't take hmm. seeing my work being used by those bloodsuckers. But there's nothing I can do about it, so let's talk about something else. Something else I can help you with? No, that's it apparently. All right, we're all healed up. Everybody's force points is regenerated. Those two bodies have been looted. And let's uh, 
Let's go check out the beach. Anything useful here, or is this just uh, another map filling exercise? Ooh, what's in the bag? A, a grenade. Okay, I mean, it's better than no grenades, right? Anything around? Nope. And they won't let you run out to the sea. And it looks like we get to have another adventure. Alright, so let's do this before... Ooh. Let's... How do I want to do this? See, I don't want to engage in the... Uh, whatever these are. The, the critters and then get sucked in with the mercenaries or vice versa. I'd like to have a little bit of space besides that. I always feel a sense of calm when I walk the surface of Telos. The Athorians are truly amazing in their work. The force is strong here. Whether Chodo and his herd has anything to do with that is another matter. Can you feel anything? Um, I can feel frustration at being interrupted as we're on our way to combat. Especially that guy, right there, the one waving at us. He seems a little disappointed, too. Alright, um... No, I feel nothing but empty. No, we'll go with a whisper, perhaps, like a breeze through the glass. Grass. That mm. is good. As a breeze may swiftly turn to a gale, you are slowly beginning to be reopened to the force. Quiet. There's a large mercenary patrol up ahead. If we move carefully along the perimeter, we may be able to get by without their spotting us. We could cross along <coughs> the shore. I head along the cliffs to the south. Uh, no need to hide. Let's take them all out. Uh, let's try along the shore. Close. Dude, like, for serious. Yeah, this is real quiet. Good thing nobody over there noticed us. No, don't run towards him, you... Ah. Fine. Oh, are you... Guys, are you serious? Fine. This is not... This is so not what I wanted to be in the middle of. Could have saved earlier. You know what? We need to cancel a lot of stuff and start getting some energy shields up. And, uh, you know what? Granal strength. Bam. Alright, and then we'll try to do some more cut-ups. Let's, uh... Cancel all that stuff. Let's get an energy shield up pronto. Um, all right, fine. And then we'll get some flurries in. Oh, she's dead already? <sighs> all right. Let's, let's see what we can do. Um, well, shoot. Now he's dead. Alright, time to bravely run away. Are they following? They're following. Alright, let's see how far we can kite some of these guys. Oh! Oh, that failed! Well, shoot. Um, oh, oh, oh. The health! The health! It's not looking good.
Alright, I need some big hits. Come on. Big hits. Kill him quicker. Oh. Oh. I hope that was an autosave at least. Oh, are you kidding me? I thought I saved sooner than that. Nope. We had just finished. Are you kidding me? All right. We had finished leveling him up and equipping him, and then... All right, note to self, I need to save a little more frequently because some of these... Because <laughs> apparently my minions are going to drag me into con uh, confrontations I really don't want to be in. And I can't seem to dial back their aggression. Like, that chick, no matter what actions you cue, she will, she will just tear in there. All right, um... That 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 just rots. Yes. Let me handle this. Alright. Yeah, we'll leave him that aggressive. Let's get this over with. Did I finally get her to change to support at least? Well, we've all got speed boosts and other buffs. So maybe. And she... Oh, yeah, that's going to get old quick. I, I just need the, uh, the $6 million man effects. <laughs> All right, that is, that is kind of nice. All right, remind me to save as soon as I knock out those guys over there, because uh, that that was just a special kind of frustrating. I did not let's need go. that today. All right, let's bump in I'm into solo mode and recover some mines. At least two hidden caches like this. We should keep our eyes open. Why? Well, thank you. What's going on? Thank you, Captain Obvious. Alright, let's recover these guys. Ah, oh, that... And I know better. I know I should be saving more frequently. And I should have known that she was gonna... I Alright. I think what I need to do is uh, I'll need to solo mode my character and try to kite them back to these guys. Uh, at least the beasties. Alright, something different in this cache then? No. Okay. Mercenaries. Right where we need to go. They were probably Okay. Thank you for that. Alright. How do I want to do this? Let's toss a grenade. Throw up an energy shield. Do a force whirlwind and then a power attack. Trying to get him shielded. See if we can take a little less damage this go around. Then we'll go from there and we'll see if we can't get her to get a shield up as well. He is in Jedi support mode, which is good, at least. That. Okay, I was getting ready to say that did not look like Jedi support much. 
<laughs> All right, come on, queue up the attacks. a lot of misses. Let's uh let's try to get those flurries back in. Wait, who fell? Oh seriously. This is just not my day. Um I gotta keep a closer eye on everybody's health. Doggone it. Gamma. Cut him down quicker. Oh, should probably lead with that. Because I know that's a little more effective. Come on, lady. You, you went from uber aggressive to not. Awfully quick. Alright. Cut it! Alright. Nothing to loot there. Now he's going to get back up. That gets everybody back up to health a little bit quicker. We can still get our force pike off of... No. Just the money. This guy had the force pike. Alright. That reminds me. Uh, ooh. Ooh. I need to find somebody that takes heavy armor for sure. Defense bonus of 12? Yes, please. And a bunch of immunities? Oh, yeah. Always nice. Alright. Some new mines to play with. Force Pike. There we go. Not upgradable. Okay, that makes it a little less, a little less nice. Uh, 2 to 12 damage, 25% chance to stun for 6 seconds, with a really low DC. What do, uh, what do I got now? 4 to 15, 4 to 13. Oh no. Ah. Alright, so that's got a Vibber Braid and a Longsword. Let's just, uh, because... That's 2 to 13. That's 2 to 12. And... And that was 1 to 10. But it has some bonus damage. So technically 3 to 13? Eh, let's try the force bike. That's where we're trying to go with this thing anyway, right? Better attack. 5 to 15. 3 to 13. Eh. Let's try it. Let's see how it goes. And while we're here, let's go ahead and save the game this time. Okay. After that uh, little resetting disaster, I'm going to go ahead and insert a cut for the episode split later on, take a really quick breather, and then we'll be right back. Well, that was fun. Unless I just died. Then it was a little less than fun. I hope you've enjoyed. I hope you're having fun. And... If you want to watch live, you can follow along on Twitch. I live stream the recording of the next six episodes at least once a week. I might even throw in some bonus content here and there if time allows. And you'll find the link in the description below. Also, if you haven't already, please subscribe to the YouTube channel. That way you'll get notified when new episodes go up, live stream archives from some of my other stuff, and various and sundry other videos. Because I do more than just this. And if you want to get notifications, don't forget to hit the bell. 
And if you really, truly enjoyed it, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and all that good fun stuff. If you have any questions, queries, quips, scopes, comments, complaints, or other whatnot, don't forget to leave those in the comments down below. Lastly, if you're enjoying the show, if you're getting some value out of it, then consider giving a lot of value back. Go to live.anonjunior.com. It'll take you to the Streamlabs page where you can tip or donate, however you want to think about it. And there's no preset amount because this is a straight up value for value proposition. So if you're getting value out of the show and you would like to give a little value back, even if it's just enough for a cheap cup of coffee, then uh, consider going, giving a little bit, especially if it tickled the nostalgia or open your eyes to a new game that you might play. And uh, with all that said and done, we're uh, we're going to cut out, have fun, enjoy, and I'll see you next time.